Good morning, Patriots! Welcome to Rex Pines TV. I'm Rose Donna Lorenzo. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations, passion, and perseverance. Thank you. You may not be seated. Today is Thursday, April 8th, 2021. Let's go to Annalisa to see what happened today in history. Thank you, Yozdani. Today in history on April 8th, 2003, it was reported that springtails, also known as snow fleas, long thought to be among the oldest ancestors of insects, did not come from insects, but rather are associated with the separate group that was formed even before crustaceans and insects came about, making them prehistoric. They received the snow flea nickname because of the ability to jump from place to place and action similar to that of fleas. Now let's go to Chris for the sports highlight. Thank you, Annalicia. Today's sports highlights are presented to you by the Patriots. A skydiver solves a Rubik's Cube as he free falls. Solving the Rubik's Cube in 60 seconds may not seem important. In fact, it is painfully slow considering that 15-year-old world record holder Colin Burns can complete it in a mere 5.25 seconds. However, figuring out the cube during a free fall jump certainly takes some skill, not to mention a lot of courage. That is why skydiver Chris Walker's recent accomplishment is amazing. In the video posted on YouTube, the daredevil leaps off an airplane from what appears to be a high altitude. He then calmly solves the puzzle as if he has all the time in the world. When done, he casually opens his parachute and then glides back to Earth. Thank you, Chris. Today's lunch is pancake and sausage, potato wedges, apple cranberry juice, ketchup, syrup, barbecue sauce, and milk. Bon appetit! Now let's go back to Yostani. Thank you, Peyton. Patriots, the yearbook is currently on sale. Order your yearbook before this Friday, April 9th to get the pre-production rate of $25. After April 9th, the cost will rise to $30. All yearbook mu purchases must be made through myschoolbucks.com. Get your yearbook today. Scholars, this month we will show that we are FSA ready. Every day we will have an activity that is FSA related. Today, teachers should be playing an FSA or NWEA themed Kahoot or Jeopardy with their class. As always, teachers, please share any interesting videos or photos to the RPTV OneDrive. And finally, today's a half day, so you enjoy some extra time at home. We will be back at school tomorrow. Now, let's see what the weather is going to be like today with David. Thank you, Yost Donnie. Today's weather in Pembroke Pines, Florida is forecast to be 83 degrees Fahrenheit and mostly sunny. Everybody always talks about the weather, but nobody does anything about it. Now let's go to Tema for the joke of the day. Thank you, Dave. And here's today's joke of the day. What animal needs to wear a wig? A bald eagle. Now is your song of today's birthday. <laughs> Thanks, Samuel. That was super funny. Today's with the boys and girls are Stacia Scott. Patrick Corzo, Alexander Nada, and Isaac Chotland. Happy birthday! Let's go back to you, Donnie. Thank you, Sonia. Patriots, don't forget your past expectations. It represents, present yourself positively, act kindly towards others, treat the school is about respectfully, and succeed at everything. Congrats to Ms. Samuel, Ms. Manon, Mr. Bonilla, Mr. Mraz, Ms. Julian, Ms. Albitas, Ms. Newton, Ms. Andy Stevan, Ms. Calabrese, Ms. Adam Denkwa, Ms. Barrow, and Ms. Escher. You all had the correct answer to yesterday's riddle, which was, what is the next in the sequence? J-F-M-A-M-J-J-A-S-O in the first letter of the months of the year. Now for today's riddle. What makes you young? Again, what makes you young? Teachers, please send your answers to pines.renaissance at gmail.com before 10 a.m. in order for response to be reviewed. When will be announced the following day? Everyone on RBTV would like to wish you all a thoughtful Thursday. And don't forget, remember, unite, rise. Have a great day.